Rhea Ripley, Liv Morgan, a DQ victory and an unplanned one for Rhea Ripley as she gets the win, but no title against Liv Morgan. Our boy, Dirty Dominic, Dominic Mysterio up in a shark cage and was absolutely acting petrified. And I think he got more heat than anybody else did in this match. Um, a rather awkward finish with the DQ as Raquel Rodriguez comes in, interferes in the match. And it was supposed to apparently be a live getting dropped on Rhea after Raquel knocked her out. But the referee was facing the wrong direction and saw everything and had to DQ her. And also, by the way, very interesting use of that ref cam. As we heard Rhea ask the referee, hey, do you mind if I go out and take care of some business while Dom was hanging upside down from the shark cage? And ref was like, yeah, go ahead. You're not getting count out. Just go do it. I don't know if it was one of the worst or funniest moments in professional wrestling history, but it was interesting. Uh, Stu, I'll start with you on this match. Boy, it just turned into a a bomb at the end but it, it was a little bit of a comedy of errors i mean the funny thing Rhea beating dom like a pinata that was that was great i loved it uh the raquel rodriguez interference look i'm all for her showing a, a mean side you know we went through all that that you know her baby face run and all she did was smile i mean it was reminding me of jonathan ogden from the ravens and Jonathan Agnes had <laughs> has the best smile in the NFL. But so I, I get wanting to show a little bit of bad side with Raquel, but yeah, that was that was a that was a comedy of errors. The and and look, the ref did what he was supposed to do because that's something you know when you learn as a wrestling referee, your call your you're uh you know enforcing whatever rules there are. And if you see it, you got to call it. So, yeah, he saw the interference. He had to call the DQ. I mean, that's so no heat. On, it should be no heat on the ref. That's no. that's on that's on Liv and Rhea. So. Yeah, pretty interesting. Jason, what do you think of this whole thing? I think while it was a comedy errors, I think the WWE is going to get a really nice spin out of it. Personally, uh, I, I think the fact that the ref had to call it as DQ, you still have the fact that that you know, Rhea has not lost her title. You know, it's still, they still get to play the angle. You now have Raquel Rodriguez back in the mix now as, as the muscle on the women's side of Judgment Day. It also now allows her to eventually, me personally thinking that eventually she's going to be the one to turn on Liv and take the title. And now you set up Liv, or you set up uh, Raquel versus Rhea in a, in a much bigger match than what you're going to get out of, out of uh, Rhea and Liv. I, I think it's a, they have a really good chance to spin this in a positive way. Comedy of errors, yes. But if it's done right, it can turn into gold for them. Yeah. Well, one thing, Phil, that a lot of people noticed was that the crowd wasn't really that excited about Raquel showing up. And, and I don't know if that's just because they couldn't really tell who she was. I mean, she was dressed in black and you know, it, was, it was pretty sudden for you know, where, where she came out of the blue. I, I'm actually there watching be any concern. I was gonna say I was actually watching the clip of it. And you're right. I think when she pops up, it's like it's hard to see. You're crouched down. It's right in the spot. You're not in the ring, which is a raised platform. So the crowd doesn't even I don't I don't think even initially see it until they finally get in the ring. And by then, well, the actions already happened. So, yeah. Yeah. So this will be interesting to see uh, how this all works out. And, you know, it, it's good to see Raquel back though. I mean, you know, everything she went through, uh, you know, happy to see her doing her thing and uh, well, she'll be hanging out with Liv for a little while. So we'll keep an eye on that one. Hi, pro wrestling fans. Marco here. I'd really appreciate it. If you would take a moment to join the Marco show family and please click on the subscribe button below. Also, please stick around and check out the incredible sponsor of this video. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you again on the Mark Hoke Show YouTube channel. Want a matching bonus up to 500 bucks and have fun betting on pro wrestling plus all your favorite sports and entertainment events? Then you need to check out betonline.ag. Bet on all the top wrestling events, plus you can get a free 50% matching bonus up to $1,000 on your initial deposit. 
Just go to MarkHokeShow.com, click on the BetOnline.ag link, and use sign-up code BOL1000 to get in on the action today and receive your 50% matching bonus. So get in on all the betting excitement. Sign up right now on MarkHokeShow.com with BetOnline.ag.